In this video, I'm going to show you how you can upload a file to OneDrive and then share it with other people via a link. So what you first need to do is come to OneDrive. The easiest way is just to Google it. Just go to Google, search for OneDrive, and then it should be the first one. Now you're going to need to sign in with your Microsoft account. So click sign in and the chances are you might already be logged in. So click sign in and it will take you straight to OneDrive. If not, just sign in with your Microsoft account. Now once you're here, you've got five gigabytes of free data. You can do whatever you want with that. So you wanna to go to add new in the top left hand corner, then click files upload. And then it's gonna upload this window here where you can choose your file. So I'm gonna to go to my desktop and I'll choose this PDF example file. We can then go ahead and click open. So once you've uploaded your file, it should then show the progress at the bottom. Mine is a very small file, so it's just uploaded. Now we can exit out of this and go and find the file. It should just be in this section here called My Files. And what you can do is you can find your file and it's gonna tell you the file size and it is currently private. So we're gonna change that. So if I go ahead and click on the file, like if I double click on the file, it will open it and I can then share it, copy the link or download it. I'm gonna go ahead and click on share and then that's gonna open the share window. From here, we can go ahead and either invite people or if you just want to share it via a link, you can go ahead and copy this link. Now by default, if you click on it, anyone with the link will be able to edit it or share it. If you want them just to be able to view it and download it, you wanna change this just to view. So now we've got anyone with the link can view it. Now click apply and it's gonna then give you a unique link which you can give to the people who you want to view your files. Then when the people click on your link, it's then going to take them to this window and they'll then be able to see and download your file. In this case, it is the PDF. They could open it or they could download it. So that's how to do it. I hope that did help you out.